will show you the custom CSS for fields. It's not available for input fields, but for other elements, we will show you where you can find the custom CSS. So I'll give you an example here. So let's say I take a button, I drag the button over, and then where you will find it is in the styling section. It will always be there, which is over here. Click on the styling, and then the option is located at the bottom. It's called user CSS. And if you can expand that, this is where you can go and add your custom CSS here and then apply it. And it is per element, so this is where you do it. Now, as the thumbnail suggested, that it's not available for input field because this is what will happen. So if you go to input field, let's say you drag something like this and you click on uh, the style icon, you can see that it's not available anywhere. So it's not possible at the moment. However, if you just want to you know, work with, let's say, widgets even, for example, let's say I drag like a date range widget here, and you know, you fancy adding some CSS, by all means, it's available to you. So that's something you need to be aware of, that it is available, but just not available for input fields. But this is where you will find it. Click on the styling icon, and then from there on, right at the bottom, you will always have user CSS available to you that you can apply per element. And that's it.